a beautiful day out here. Welcome to my shop. I'm Captain Eddie Castellan. We get together regularly to talk about wood turning and how you can advance your skills and things you can do and projects you can come over with. Got some stuff to show you and you know the deal. You know the deal. You gotta watch. Every month I get a plethora Rose told it is a plethora of submittals to my web to my email page. Now I get them on the phone, I get them on message, I get them on Facebook, I get them on this, and I get them on that. If you don't send it to me at my email address, that's this one right here, CaptainEddieCastle at gmail.com. See it? If you don't send it to this address, I can't use it in the videos because some of the best turners in the entire world send me some of their work every month pictures of their work. They send me samples of the work. They send me wood. They send me all kinds of stuff. You can too. Remember the address right here. Right there. And if you send it to that address, I'll show it just like now. You ready? Let's go. We're going to start by taking a piece by Kevin Cooper. That's nice. I like the way you work that edge in. It really makes it accent. Then we'll move over to Jim Selby. He did some of those Bic pens I talk about. And they came out nice. And then Joran Cody did a four-sided bolt. Well, wait, 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 wait. This is supposed to be round. This is wood turning. Come on, Jim. Then Norm Benjamin. Norm made this Longworth-type jig using parts from us. And then we've got this from Tony Bruno. A uh, really nice piece of work. Uh, I like the accents of it. Gary Skiladoni, I hope that name's right. He turned that out of that and came out really cool. This is by Michael Viselio. Uh, a little combination of parts and pieces here. Then Freddie Bean put in a couple of pins he did with bases. These are the big ink pen type things using a base. Glad I got that in. Larry Briggs did this little jar. Looks good. I like the way the lid comes up over the edges. That'll cover any sins. David Duran did this. Talk about a sin. Look at the side of that thing. But David worked it through. Came out pretty nice. And the accent on a cover. And then Bill Fields did this. Hey, Bill, there's a hoop around the bottom. Oh, wait, there's two hoops around the bottom of your mug. That's nice. How was that, right? That's worth, well, well, well worth ringing the bell for, right? Some really beautiful work. Some guys say, oh, this is the best I can do. It's the best you can do. That's all I'm looking for. I'm not looking to put it in the gallery or anything. It's in this gallery. It's right here. It's where it's supposed to be, in the memory of a friend. So if you got something and you want to share it with me, send it to my address. Remember, there's the address. Don't send it to messages, Facebook, Happy Times, Starbusters. Any of those things, don't, don't, none of those. Don't send it, send it to my address, and then I'll be able to use the photograph. And about once a month, I'll pop in, and do a little work, and put them all up on it, and you get to enjoy them. Now, a couple of things coming up. Uh, I got to remind you again that the world's finest wood turning seminar workshop meeting is in Waco, Texas, the last weekend, last full weekend of August 2019, 21, 24, 25, something like that. Hey, you don't know where to go? Go to SWATTurners.org. SWATTurners.org. Not dot com. SWATTurners. Watch the T. S-W-A-T-U-R-N-E-R-S. Dot org. And the date will be there. And in fact, in a couple of days, you'll be able to register for the 2019 version. They got pictures from the 18 version, and the 16 version, and 14 version, and 12 version. And they have all that. Another thing. I'm up to eggs. In eggs. Where are they? I'll be doggone it. I've dropped my eggs. I had a couple of eggs to show you. I'm spinning some eggs. It's a semi Easter thing. Ronnie and I were talking the other day about doing something for the kids for the holidays. You can do Christmas trees and Santas for Christmas. You can do crazy looking bottle stoppers for St. Patrick's Day. You can do anything you want for Mardi Gras. But we were talking about doing eggs. And I said, you know the problem when you egg? There's a little bit of problem with some turners. I went to work in a hardware store and came up with a jig that'll hold them. You have to see this rig. I'm putting it together, but first, 
send me those photographs. I'm Captain Eddie Castellan. Let's see, what was I doing? A lot of you in shopping, I'm making shavings. That's what I'm doing, making shavings. Good to have you around. Take care.